Opposing groups climbed the 72 steps of the Tennessee State Capitol 100 years ago and witnessed the deciding moment to ratify the 19th Amendment, granting women the right to vote. The Nashville Ballet's second company, NB2, brings this historic event to life through contemporary ballet. Join me as we take a look on this week's Arts Break. 72 steps refers to the 72 steps of the Tennessee State Capitol that the women climbed to await that final decision. We've been talking a lot of, in rehearsal about, yes, 72 steps, but there's like maybe 72,000 more to go. You know, like we take one step at a time. Small steps of progress is, is good. Empowering people, letting young people, young women know their power and understand their power in this world is incredibly important for us. And the story is pretty timeless and incredibly relevant. This was a deeply personal plight and fight that was affecting both the movement but also the personal engagement of like, don't I deserve these rights that um, you have? And it was so interesting to read some of the anti stuffs who were like, why do I need a voice? I have a husband or a brother. There's the issue of women's rights, but there's lots of discriminations and inequalities that go across the board that are just tucked into the piece. Even now, that if I said, do you think I deserve equality in this way and the same rights as you, they would say, absolutely. But when it comes down to it, Harry Byrne was voting no. You know, he was saying no. So to have his mother challenge him and say, do you really think this? Harry Byrne changed his vote at the last minute from against suffrage to for suffrage, and it said that he was swayed by a letter from his mother convincing him that he should change his vote. It was something really unexpected, and so I think it's important for people, uh, and young people especially, to know that it can, one vote can make a difference and not take for granted the right to vote because their voice does matter. People don't even know how much power they have with their vote. There's a feeling of powerlessness and a feeling of like futility in, in uh, why should I vote? It's not gonna matter anyway, right? I think when you see this story danced in front of you and you start to understand the broader concept, it is incredibly meaningful. So that's why I think it's an important story to tell and how wonderful that we can use this ballet, this educational tool for many years to come. Commissioned by the League of Women Voters of Nashville, 72 Steps will be performed for students in Metro Nashville Public Schools. For more information, visit us online at wnpt.org arts. This NPT Arts Break is made possible by the generous support of the Martha Rivers Ingram Advised Fund of the Community Foundation of Middle Tennessee.